All right, I wanted to go over my gear list real quick for the hike that's coming up tomorrow morning. We're going to Vermont, a uh, small section of the long trail that I'm looking forward to. Okay, I got my REI Traverse uh, trekking poles with the GoPro attached to it. Um, they're aluminum and I, and I like these. Um, I have my Vormi long sleeve hoodie. It's a merino wool. Uh, my bandana and Patagonia shorts that are running shorts basically with like the liner in there. Um, my Ultra Temp 2, I think, or 1.5 maybe. Um, I got the speed laces in there. I like these. Um, darn tough socks. They're the, uh, they're like the crew length for bug protection. Ultra uh, I'm sorry, Dirty Girl Gators, and my Waymark gear fanny pack, which has got like, you know, snacks, and I can carry my phone in there. Also my phone, uh, which is a uh, Samsung. That's all the worn weight gear. Okay, over here is my uh, Enlighten Equipment Torrid Synthetic Puffy. Um, I have a bug net and a buff. This is my rain gear. It's got the Z-Pax Virtus uh, rain jacket and this is uh, ULA um, rain skirt. I've got rain mitts from Mountain Laurel Designs and these are called body wrapper. Um, they're, they're like nylon pants that I treated with DWR um, more for wind protection than it is rain protection. Okay, tent is the Z-Pax Duplex. And then uh, over here is the seal skin uh, socks that I can use for camp if my shoes are wet. Um, instead of get, keep staying into my wet socks and getting uh, messy feet, just throw these on. These are um, darn tough. They're the short ones for um, sleeping in, in Gingy also. A spare set, um, smart wool, short sleeve merino um, shirt to change into or to sleep in, ex officio boxer briefs. Um, these are all kind of like stuff to change into or camp. Um, this is my quilt, which is an Enlightenment Equipment um, Revelation, and it's uh, 20 degree. Okay, we have the uh, Lucy Lantern. It's an inflatable solar lantern. Uh, chargers and battery bank for my phone, my GoPro, uh, the Nightcore NU25 headlamp that most people are aware of. Um, and that's my electronics, basically. Um, and here is my toothbrush and um, vitamins and I found these um, chewable toothpaste tabs uh, cash and card uh, this is going to be uh, repair and um, kind of like repair and first aid and stuff like that it's fire starting I got found this Bic lighter that's got an extension to it I use this ball to roll on my feet. There's some uh, insect repellent in there, chapstick, uh, matches, hand warmers, um, ibuprofen in there, and um, stuff like that. This is uh, my poop bag. Um, I also keep my body glide in there. Um, these are wet wipes, individual uh, wipes. Um, no, there's not much to that. Okay, I have my sorry squeeze and uh, the Vecto knock bag. I think it's the two liter. Um, this is a bear bag line. It's 50 feet. And um, I switched my bear bag to, uh, or the rock bag, um, to this one so that it could fit um, these stakes. 
and my trowel as well. So I have my two spades trowel and one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, six shepherd's hooks and then three V stakes. And then these are platform stakes. Um, they help when you're on the platforms that are in New England. Okay, this is my Sea to Summit uh, Eros pillow, and it's the large one. Uh, and this is uh, a pump sack to help fill up my Nemo Tensor, let's see, uh, regular wide insulated sleeping pad. Um, and then last but not least is my, my pack. I got, it's a Waymark Gear Evolve 35 liter. Um, and uh, on it is, well, I have my, my water bottles. I carry a small, small one and a one liter. I don't know how big this one is, but this one I use for uh, like electrolyte drinks. And this one doesn't, I don't put anything in it. Uh, bandana, spare bandana. Um, this is for my glasses, to wipe out, wipe off my glasses. A little um, Swiss Army knife, my long hander spoon. Uh, this is uh, like a microfiber towel for my tent, and uh, this is the Helinox Trail Zero Chair Zero chair, um, and then I have it wrapped up with my Nemo um, Velcro. That covers it. Looking forward to the trip.